Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. The IDOS project Aura is another most secretive aircraft project of the Indian government which is aimed to develop an unmanned stealth deep penetration strike bomber for the Indian Armed Forces. It's being developed in two phases. In phase one, a smaller version of UCAF called SWIFT or a stealth wing flying test bed will be developed. In phase two, actual and bigger UCAF will be developed which will be known as Ghatak. SWIFT will act as a flying test bed for Ghatak UCAF before developing a full-scale product. Our today's update will be around SWIFT UCAF. Last year, in June, India has started the ground-level trials of the first assembled prototype of its SWIFT. The taxi trials of the UCAF has completed successfully for both slow and fast speeds. It has got clearance for the first full flight which we are expecting soon. The CVID laboratory of DIDO has indigenously designed and developed 3-ton retractable landing gear RLG system for TAPAS and 1-ton landing gear system for SWIFT UAV. In January 2021, CVID handed over retractable landing gears for TAPAS and SWIFT unmanned aerial vehicles as well as 18 types of filters for Project 75 submarines. Now, as for the latest update, CVID has now issued a fresh RFP for strength testing of one ton main landing gear and nose landing gear which means it's going to be for swift the landing gears will be tested for minimum and maximum load conditions now talking about swift and ghatak program swift uav is one ton scale down model of ghatak and ghatak will weigh around 15 to 16 ton swift will have a wingspan of 5 meters and length of 4 meters it will have a range of 200 km and service ceiling of 6 km with endurance of 1 hour. SWIFT is at present powered by NPO Saturn 36 MT turbofan engine. The plan is to replace it by Manic small turbofan engine STFE at later stage which has already been successfully tested on nearby cruise missile. The full scale version of SWIFT that is Ghatak UCAF will be powered by a dry Kaveri engine variant which can generate a maximum thrust of 52 kN. It is said to employ fluid thrust vectoring exhaust nozzle, which will provide the ability to an aircraft, rocket or UCAV to manipulate the direction of thrust from its engine to control the attitude or angular velocity of the vehicle. It is expected that the first flight of the first prototype of Ghatak UCAV will be conducted by 2024. The UCAF will be capable of releasing missiles, bombs, precision guided munitions. It will be India's combat drone with stealth flying wing concept aircraft having internal weapons bay and a turbofan engine. This was today's update. Please let us know what is your views about these in comment section. Feel free to post your comments and suggestions about any topic related to defense sector on which you want to hear from us. With this, I would like to say goodbye and jai hind friends. Please like and subscribe our video if you have not done already. We will be soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in defense sector.